Okay, I'm Gareth Bunting. I'm a visual artist. I'm originally from Rugeley in Staffordshire. I went to university in Sheffield, so I lived there for about five years. And then since then I've been kind of like traveling around doing artist residencies. Like I lived in China for a couple of years. I um, lived in Taiwan for a while, in London, and now I'm kind of coming back home. And so I'm doing this artist residency in Derby, which isn't too far away from sort of usually where I'm originally from. So it's kind of gone full circle. Whew, I feel like I've always been an artist in some ways, you know? I mean, I, I, even as a very young kid, I was always drawing, always kind of playing, making up my own sort of worlds and stories and things, you know? Um, I guess I was just kind of good at art in school and then I studied at university and then that's when I really sort of realised I could be an artist, you know. Yeah, it's evolved a lot. I mean, it used to be about kind of like space and place and I mean, I, I used to kind of like travel around quite a lot and I'd, I was always kind of drawing from memory, you know, based on the sort of places that I've been to and experiences that I've had in those places. But I feel like recently it's become more, um, rather than kind of just space and place, it's like space and place and virtual space as well, you know? I've been very inspired by kind of virtual reality and social media and things like that. So it's evolved a lot. Um, it's evolved from kind of like ink drawing into abstract painting and then back again and then sort of making my own worlds in virtual reality and then putting those back into, you know, ink paintings again. Um, yeah, it's constantly evolving. I get a lot of ideas while I'm moving, you know, while I'm traveling. Um, you know, I think a lot of my best ideas come while I'm just sort of on the train, you know, going somewhere or, um, but I mean, I'm very inspired by a lot of like other artists and, you know, people that I speak to and, um, yeah, I mean, ideas can come from anywhere, really, you know. I think it's um, through kind of symbolism and through contrasts, through sort of, yeah, like sort of contrasting different things on one kind of piece of paper, um, that's how you can sort of tell a story you know, using uh, like repeated sort of imagery. It's almost like a Rorschach test, you know? Sometimes I'll just kind of, I'll just make this kind of abstract sort of splodge of ink and different kinds of chemicals and things on a canvas or on a piece of paper, and I'll kind of draw into it. And I find sometimes that something from my sort of subconscious mind kind of comes out of it sometimes, you know? Like I find it like by sort of drawing into these sort of fractal, sort of forms it's almost like studying a language you know so it's like I found that by doing that I was able to draw you know natural things like, like trees and rocks and clouds and water just from memory because of the sort of fractal sort of forms that are found in like in those like um, objects you know I suppose we're all just sort of stardust really you know and, um, and we always will be so I suppose I'm trying to kind of remind people of that, you know, that we are nature and we're not, you know, sort of in this kind of battle against it, even though it seems like that sometimes, you know. So, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to kind of bring it back to that environmental issues and climate change and things like that. So um, that's that's going to be a big topic that I'm dealing with, I think, in my work. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to show people that we are part of nature, you know, not against it. I'd quite like to sort of like interact with other local artists, other, you know, sort of gallery people, universities, you know, in this area. Uh, I want to make, you know, really uh, and great artwork um, and hopefully give something back to the community, you know. I want to put on some workshops, you know, with kids and with, um, kids and adults. Um, let's see if I can actually teach them to kind of paint, you know, and, um, and kind of, you know, open up a discussion about like some of the ideas that are in my work, you know, some of the themes.